day, technically two, uh, no, on the three, ship. Three. On the ship. Because day one oh, is yeah, embarkation. Was day yeah, yesterday was day at sea, and today is. You lose track of time. You do. Today is what was supposed to be Dawes Glacier. However, it does sound like there's too much ice to go to Dawes Glacier. So now they're uh, having us go to another glacier. It's a little bit of a longer name, so I can't quite catch it, but we'll put it down here at the bottom yeah. for what exactly, which, which glacier it is. But I do know we are going into Tracy Arm. Yes. I think is the like channel we're going in. Yes. Tracy <laughs> Arm. As opposed to Indicott Arm. Yes. Which we're actually going to be passing by. Yeah. But we're, we're actually, what we were just listening, there's already been a bunch happening, so we're trying to film this so we can get up on deck real quick. Yes. Uh, but we have someone that is local to this area that is describing all the wildlife that we can possibly see on the starboard side. We're on the port side, so we need to get up on deck so we can see it. Uh, but she said we have the possibility of seeing brown bear, bald eagles, uh, mountain goats, a whole assortment of things and we've already seen like 10 whales this morning as it is which this all happened before we were ready and so this yeah. is all happening as we're getting ready we will do a little like throwback right here to about maybe an hour ago we'll show you all that excitement that happened right now wander wisdom for you all when I mean this is assuming that you have a veranda but if you have a veranda on an Alaskan cruise and you're in potential whale watching vicinities leave your door cracked because you will if you you know need to do stuff that's in your veranda moving around getting ready or whatever uh, sorry I said in your veranda <laughs> Thank you. In your room, if you're needing to move around, get ready or whatever. If you have your door cracked a bit, you'll likely hear people's exclamations as they're seeing whales. That's actually how we noticed that there were whales out there. That's how we knew is because we heard other people exclaiming about it. So, and that was only because we had our veranda cracked. So just some wonder wisdom there, leave your veranda cracked. That will help you hear if people are seeing whales. How cool was that? Yes. Oh my gosh, can you imagine? That was basically kind of what we woke up to. We were like slowly well, starting to get ready. And, and I, then... ho hopefully it comes across on the camera. <sighs> um, they were kind of far away and we can only zoom in so much. Mm -hmm. So what our eyes saw, especially through the binoculars, mm -hmm much better than what you guys are seeing right now. So you may be seeing that and being like, okay, that wasn't really anything. <laughs> it was but amazing. Yeah, it, it was close to 10 whales. I would say like eight to 10 whales, depending upon, we may have saw a few twice and didn't realize that they had mm -hmm. moved that far or something like that. But well, yeah, um, Cheyenne's Wander Wisdom comes in perfectly right here. Keep your, if you're on a veranda, keep it cracked a little bit. Cause the only reason we heard or saw those is because someone else was freaking out about them. And we ran out onto the veranda. Today is some glacier that we'll put at the bottom. We're going into Tracy Arm though. And we are not getting off the boat uh, to do the little boats to get closer to the glacier. We've already said that, but we're going to be up on deck trying to get the characters in their cool Alaska get, uh, costumes. And then uh, we will be just looking at nature, basically. 
I'm sure later on tonight, maybe we'll do some crew or uh, some trivia or something like that. We'll figure it out. But right now, our plan is just to go see some wildlife, take in all the ambiance of the location, and hopefully get it across on camera as best as we possibly can. I think it's already been a great start to the day with all the whales that we saw, yep. so I'm hopeful for the rest of the day. So come on and wander with us through day three aboard the Disney Wonder here in Alaska as we go to a glacier that again we will put at the bottom. Again. <laughs> Cheyenne is wearing her bear beanie to channel seeing the bears. Seeing bears. So hopefully. When we go up to uh, bears. Bears, bears, bears. <laughs> All the and what we get to experience today. And, and so it's pretty exciting. And I'm so excited that this is one of my favorite parts as we pass. She's so cute. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, my goodness. It's like my favorite mini costume. <laughs> The lines to meet the characters are no joke. I did not realize that they were this bad. Like it is past the what is that? The concierge lounge back there. Yeah. And goes all the way. All the way to almost, that funnel right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where she. Yeah, she's at the funnel. So the line goes all the way here, and it's still going behind us a bit. Like, that's wild. That's crazy. I did not expect the lines to be that. I bad. do want to meet a character, but not if it's like I that. Know. I'm okay walking by and filming them from afar. Yeah, that's, that's the unfortunate thing. It's with them being the Alaskan characters, this is the only time that you get to see them yeah. like this. Maybe so. we'll catch like Coda or someone because they don't do a stop and take pictures, they just wander. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Yeah. So right. we'll see who we meet, but yeah. just FYI, yeah. the character lines are crazy. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so with Alaska cruises, they usually offer hot chocolate and it's, we actually haven't really seen it out yet, but it's out today. Obviously, since it is a little bit colder out, but even still, it's, it's, it's still, still pretty warm. Yeah, sun. it's still surprisingly warm. The, the past few days have been surprisingly warm. Yeah. I was not prepared for this, but there's still hot chocolate, which is exciting. <laughs> so we can get a little extra in it too if you want some. Uh, ooh. Oh my god! <laughs> Thank you. Bring yourself. Okay, I'm gonna let it cool for a bit. <laughs> Not like you that just goes for it. Okay, <laughs> I'm curious though, like, is this, like, what kind of hot chocolate are we talking here? Like, was this made with water? Was it made with milk? That's probably the hot, the hot chocolate mix, I would assume. They're not gonna melt their own chocolate here and make it that delicious thick. Yeah, but still, was it made with milk? Was it made with water? Because even that makes a big difference. That's true, yeah. <laughs> definitely see the glacier exploration boats being worth it if you're not doing anything else that has to do with glaciers for the rest of the, yeah, that's true. the trip. But since we're doing the dog sledding on a glacier and then landing on a glacier and doing a walk around, I feel like that's we'll why. We'll get our fill of glacier. Yeah, we'll get our <laughs> fill of glacier not feel too bad if we can't see it today. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, the scenery around here alone. It's gorgeous. Is, yeah, it's worth it. Like, it's amazing. saw two bald eagles. I shine pointed them out. I looked through the goggles. White goggles. head. <laughs> white head, yellow beak, black body. It looked like two bald eagles on an iceberg. That was cool. Beautiful is this thing. So beautiful. This 
it's like best cruise ever. Yeah. <laughs> Brings tears to my eyes with like just how cool this is. <laughs> this is wild. Oh my god. If you love nature of any sorts, you gotta come to this. This is unbelievable. Waterfalls everywhere. We saw an iceberg flip and saw that pure blue. Two bald eagles already, whales up to 10 this morning. And it's, <laughs> we haven't even gotten off the boat yet, ship yet. There's waterfalls everywhere. The only place I've seen things like this is Yosemite Valley. This is unbelievable. Photos, videos don't do it justice. I hope ours is able to capture just a fraction of this magnificence that's all around us. Like I have quite literally been brought to tears a couple times because it is just so unbelievable to think that we're here <laughs> and seeing this. Called, Shine? South Sawyer Glacier. South Sawyer Glacier. Yeah. That's awesome to actually see a glacier in I person. Oh, and they definitely kept our expectations low this morning yeah. because it sounded as if we may not even see it at all. Yeah. So the fact that we can see it, yeah. super happy. It's awesome. Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> close to Mickey. Yeah, we're so close to Mickey. We haven't met all of the characters, but. We were fairly close to the line for Mickey once it started, so we were like, okay, why not? <laughs> I know, it's so good. Did you see the whales earlier? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, you almost got one? <laughs> How's it going? Woo! <laughs> So much. Can I get just a puppy? Yay! Can I get a wave? Oh, thank you. And then, if you wouldn't mind, a kiss. Oh, 
kiss because I love that kiss. <laughs> oh, yes, I love it. Thank you, Mickey. Thank you. <laughs> I got your room key. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> that was fantastic. Like Definitely. what a crazy experience that is. Getting pictures and meet and greets with care with Disney characters on a Disney ship in, in an the middle Alaskan of a fjord. fjord. <laughs> Like, it's just so hard to wrap your, your brain around it because yeah. it's so crazy. <laughs> Tearing up again, it's just so amazing. <laughs> you know, the characters are definitely a little bit longer of a line, uh, but that's okay, it's okay. You, we're actually, we've been in here for a long time and they just started switching out the uh, people doing the excursion for the next group. So I'm pretty sure we're gonna be uh, out here for a while longer because they have to get their money's worth uh, getting on their uh, little boats and going and seeing things so I know I've shown like a million pictures and videos of this place but just from this standpoint just look at this starting from over here on the starboard side surrounded by mountains. We are. One thing that I love is that I've seen so many cast members coming out in yes. like plain clothes or yes. even their costumes and getting pictures too. Because yeah, they deserve it, man. Yeah, oh yeah, they absolutely deserve it. Where the lights are. I would assume this side, but I don't know. Pluto is just here. So. Okay, maybe she's after Pluto. Ah, this is so cool though. I just, uh, it's just the coolest thing. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> and you couldn't ask for a better temperature today. It's chilly when the, the cool air hits you, but if you're in the sunshine, it feels amazing. A little bit. Let's see if they're going to cut it off. I don't know. Is she able to get through all these people? <laughs> Alright. Now the waiting game begins again. Yeah, we're in line. We'll see if we can meet her. Because I did really want to meet Minnie. Her dress is so yeah. cute. <laughs> what a better place to wait though. Talk about a view. Wait, let me actually put this here. On my wrist because I don't want to drop it. Please. <laughs> <laughs> all the good footage we got. So our new friends, Zach and Corey, went on the... I can never get the name right. Glacier Exploration Tour? Yes. Aha, uh -huh, okay. And how was it? Oh my gosh, it was so amazing. <laughs> we loved it. Yes. Yeah. Yay! We see so the best tour things. ever. Yeah. Good, good. Yes, it's a little pricey, but it's totally worth it. <laughs> I was going to say, now, would you do it again or at least recommend it to somebody? Definitely recommend it. Definitely okay. recommend it. Yeah, we would absolutely. probably do it again. Yeah, I'd do it again. Okay, there we <laughs> <Yeah>. go. <laughs> no, I kind of I know. Right. Now I'm like, oh man, we should have done it. Yeah, yeah. and wait, yeah. so Glacieritas, I think is what? Yes, we had Glacieritas Glacier with the ice from the water. It yeah. was awesome. So I did not um, know that you could, you could do that. Yeah. <laughs> and they actually brought a piece down so you could touch it and hold it and everything. Yeah, I've they got a picture of, of me it. holding yeah. the glacier ice. <laughs> got it. We're also in line Absolutely. for Minnie Mouse, so we have to walk and talk here. <laughs> so did, did they just a little iceberg and pull we it didn't see him do it, so it. Okay. assuming that's what they did yeah, yeah. just magically appeared right. that disney magic <laughs> yeah. i'm not gonna lie you get more done on that than what i thought you would yeah, yeah. i thought you were just gonna stand up on the ship maybe get close to a thing or two yeah. but we got close to yeah. all the waterfalls oh yeah, my god so yeah, we were, yeah we're watching the, the, of them yeah. Right right by. Boats go by. Like, oh my god they're oh, like and yeah, did right you guys get really close to the humpback whale that was yes. in there okay i was gonna say yes. i'm pretty she sure it was, it was the two orca of you well because someone said orca, orca and so i said yorka or yorka <laughs> so i said orca <laughs> and you know just telephone but it was a humpback okay all right well good to know thank you all right you ready to see Minnie? yes i'm so ready to see Minnie. hi Minnie. Oh How are you? This is the cutest dress I've ever seen, ever. <laughs> is it a one of a kind? Because I kind of want it. <laughs> but I'm guessing it's one of a kind. I think Daisy uh, helped you design it, right? Oh, Daisy <laughs> helped you. Oh my gosh. Well, that's She's got her insignia dress. in there somewhere. <laughs> yeah, we've been looking all over. We've seen humpback whales and bald eagles. And, oh, what else? Did we see anything else? Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, don't hopefully so. more, we'll see. <laughs> Man, do you mind if we get a picture with you? Yeah? 
Hello. Right, let me run over at Miss Minnie's camera first. Oh, God. Look at you guys and smile. Twirling. Oh my god, that's beautiful. <laughs> and if I could just get one more twirl. Oh, I love it. Oh my god, it's so great. Yay, thank you, Minnie. <laughs> Gotta milk it while you're there, right? <laughs> nice. Ah, yay. Okay, I'm happy. We are pretty much out of sight of the glacier right now. We feel like, well, granted, we weren't really at the front, so I don't know how long the glacier was actually in view, but I do feel like we started turning around pretty, pretty quickly. Granted, I do think if you were at the front, the glacier would have been in view for a good amount of time. So, turning back now and heading, heading back through the channel. Yeah. Back through Tracy Arms. So, yeah. it was uh, really cool seeing it though. I'm happy we were able to see it. It's interesting because this is an excursion that advertises the glacier viewing, but dependent upon the ice, tells you how quickly you, or close you can get to it. Um, I wouldn't classify this as more so a glacier viewing, but just a beautiful fjord viewing. Uh, because you see a lot of the fjord as opposed to the glacier. Yeah, that's a good point. It's more so it is a fjord viewing with the potential of seeing the glacier. Yeah, that's a fair <laughs> point. it's not actually really guaranteed. It's possible there could be too much ice for you to get up there. Too much ice or too much wildlife. Yeah, yeah. They don't we want did, to disturb we the We didn't wildlife. actually really see a lot of seals or seal pups at all, but we were able to once we got up to the glacier and came to that stop there and were turning around, we saw some seals. Yeah. They were unfortunately way too far away, I think, for any of our cameras to get, yeah. but we saw We had to look at them through the binoculars. Yeah, we, even with the binoculars, we could barely see them. Yeah. <laughs> but, I mean, you won't miss out on views like this. Mm -hmm. <sighs> <sighs> All right, I think we're gonna head down to our stateroom because we're, we want to, we've been standing for a very long time, so we want to go sit, bit. relax, and snack watch. Snack or something. Yeah, snack. And then watch all of the beautiful views go by from our veranda. Yep, mm -hmm. let's do it. Excursion people are on their way back. We've been sailing for a little bit, so we kind of met them halfway. Eleven. However, I do think it was the one from when we were heading into Tracy Arm, but still, we saw it again. <laughs> Let's go see Freeze the Night Away. <laughs> Did we have that Mickey on there? Yeah, it's been there for oh, a little okay. bit, but that's new. We are Penn State. Cool. <laughs> Good All for <right>. you. <laughs> Boy, all right. Let's see how busy it is. We're just a little late to when I wanted to be there. Once still be early there. for once. That's a full one. All right, stairs it is. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Hello! You guys going up to see the show too? So are we. Yeah. Oh my god. My face is like bright pink. I don't think I've ever seen Cody in this red before. Like I hope the show isn't in direct sunlight or else I need to put more sun or some sunscreen on. Thank you very much. That breeze feels nice though. Is it already 7.30? for our big summer blowout. Get ready to shake your booty. <laughs> Have fun, family. my life and quite possibly the last. <laughs> oh no, look, you're melting! Oh, Elsa could help us. Anna and Krista weren't back yet. What? Oh no, what's happening? Oh, looks like everything is freezing over. Hey everyone, we, we found, found Elsa. Elsa. Dear friends, I am thrilled to introduce my favorite sister. Oh, she's my only sister, Elsa. Hey sis, meet everyone. Hello.
forgot to come check in on Oaken's Maypole, but it looks like it's done. It yeah. happened, but it, it happened while we were in our room uh, watching all of the wildlife and everything and the nature. So, and as you can tell, it's, it's hopping in the atrium right now. I feel like it's getting louder. <laughs> I know. So we're at Triton's tonight for dinner and it's frozen night. Yay. So it's a different menu that one like a different one than we've ever had before. Um, and I think it's specific to Alaska cruises. So let's take a look at the menu. <laughs> All right, we have the frozen menu tonight. So here are tonight's appetizers. And if you'd like, feel free to pause it so you can look at everything that we have. We have our soup and salads here. And oh, the bread, bread selection, which honestly, I'm probably gonna get the, the typical like sourdough or, or French roll or whatever it is because I don't know how I'm, how I'm feeling about the liver pate dip. That's a, it's iffy there. Over on this side for the main courses. Good selection between chicken and salmon and pork tenderloin, strip loin, lobster. Vegetarian options, and then the lighter note offerings, which those ones look pretty, pretty familiar. Except that smoked trout salad is new. So great! Here's our frozen menu for the night. Red, lovely, yellow, lovely, red, yellow, yellow. Nope, 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 nope. Messed up on the second part. I know. <laughs> Red leather, yellow leather, red leather, right. yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. I, I, no, I didn't process that. Do it again. No, 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 no. I'm just talking. Play it back. Play it back. I'm not saying you didn't do it. I'm just saying I didn't hear it. Hey, what is this special bread here? This is. It looks like a graham cracker. This is um some sort of European bread that. I could not pronounce and I don't remember now because the menu is gone. I'm going to try a bit with butter. I don't know if you're supposed to have butter with this, but we're going to try. The only other option is liver pate, which is not happening. <laughs> That's not bad. It's like a... It's a crunchy or soft. Like an Odi cracker. Like soft crunchy. Yeah, yeah, it's not super crunchy. Like not, there are knives in my mouth crunchy, but it's also not too soft either, so mm, I would keep eating it. All right, I got Anderson's Baby Field Greens, and I think it's Anderson from Hans Christian Anderson, the original writer of, I think it was the Ice Queen. Um, could have that wrong. If we do, put it down below. But let's see how this is. Looks very similar to the one that I had yesterday, or the night before that. That was delicious. I would give it a 4.5 out of 5 pops. So tonight I got Hans's Juniper Marinated Pork Tenderloin. And it's on Spatzel. Spatzel? I don't know what that is, so we're gonna try it and see. It looks interesting. <laughs> it's not bad, but the pork tenderloin is definitely a little tough to chew, so it's not my favorite. The Spatzel is actually pretty good. I like the Spatzel but the, the poor tenderloin kind of takes it down a little bit. So I'd give this a three paws out of five. All right, here is our freezing the night away dessert menu. Look how cute that is. Freezing the night away. I miss Sven's butt. Oh, can't forget Sven's butt. Can't leave him, leave him hanging. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we've got the specialty drinks. These are usually pretty typical. I don't know how much these actually change. And then we've got the important stuff over here. We've got, ooh, warm apple pudding, chocolate floral dome, panikakin, uh, Romanoff sundae. And this is, oh, this is the one right here. I cannot wait, but I can't tell Cody because he's going to be upset. <laughs> yeah, there's that upset face. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited for it, though. And then we have the no sugar added dessert. Citron's mousse? 
So I literally offer. But I think all of that pales in comparison to a chocolate and raspberry tart. All right, this looks absolutely amazing, and I can't wait to eat it. Cody went to go film something else while I'm doing this uh, on purpose so that he wouldn't have to see me eat this deliciousness. <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks so good. Okay, here we go, here we go. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. So good. <laughs> Let me call you sweetheart. Let me call you sweetheart. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> I'm in love with you. Bum, 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 bum. With your eyes so blue. Bum, 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 bum. I only have my eyes for you. Bum, 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 bum. Happy anniversary. Thank you, so much. Thank you guys. Something like that. That's not quite how it goes. It's but life. It's beautiful. Life is beautiful. <laughs> That makes it better. It's you can wonderful. catch me on YouTube. Anyway. Got one follower. Happy <laughs> anniversary. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. It's definitely gluten free because we know that she said that she was going to mm -hmm. do that for me. It's nice. We got a happy anniversary uh, dessert. I have no idea what it is. I do know it's gluten free though, um, and it's delicious. So maybe that's all I need to know. <laughs> Tastes like like a, a specialty babe brownie, like a gluten free brownie or something like that. But I don't know. You wanna try it? Mm -hmm. okay, real quick, because I forgot to do my rating for the tart. It's very good. I wish the the crust was I don't know, maybe just something a little different, but it was still really good. Like it's almost almost the five, but I would have to give it a four point five out of five pause. It was almost there, just not quite, but still delicious. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> oh, what do we have? It's like a sheep sheep. A sheep sheep? Oh, what if it's supposed to be like a mountain goat? Or a mountain goat. I, I think it could. Uh, th this is a trifold here because it's a sheep or a ram or a mountain goat. Well, because of where we were today, that's I'm going to take it to be a mountain goat. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> fair assumption. We should also say that we found out that the yeah. the thing the, the the thing from last night the towel thing the from barnacle. last night we were like is it a barnacle is it a, a weird fish we didn't Oyster. know it was a candle a candle uh, we only found for, that out because of our yes so. thank you zach and Corey. shout out to you two for helping us with figuring out what that was we had no idea <laughs> that's why we didn't sleep well last night <laughs> We didn't know what yeah, it was. Yeah, we couldn't <laughs> sleep. <laughs> I had dreams about barnacles. Uh, oh boy. War. But Mountain candle. goat. Ah! <laughs> Shine just said that she saw three whales, so I'm on the lookout. Oh, right here. There's something in the water right there. <gasps> oh my god, you're right! Oh my god! You can see the slight disturbances on the water. Uh, it's a bird. Oh. <laughs> oh, spout behind it. Behind it. To the left, it's about to go into the shadow of the mountain. Oh, oh. Oh my god, you're right. There's so yeah. many. Yeah, there's a bunch right there. <gasps> oh my god, here it goes. I heard it. There, there's another oh, spout. There's oh, another spout. There's oh, there's oh my here. god. Yeah. What the? They're all over. I don't know if you'll see this on the camera, but. Oh my there's god. There's so many whales right That was right like here. three, four, five, six. There's like yeah. five to seven oh, here. My god. And this is at like 10.30 at night. <laughs> yep, there's his back. Or her back, I don't know. There was its back. And then I'm seeing something else up here. I don't know if those are logs or if those are... I don't know. This is crazy. Oh, oh. 
Uh, did you hear that? Yeah. He just poked his head out. Oh, I got it. I got it. Oh my god, I got it. And he, oh, they're popping up right there. Hi, Gerald. Oh my god, they're right there. All right, hello everyone. Hello. It is the end of day three. Three. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yesterday was day at sea. Glacier. <laughs> yes, day three. I kept thinking it was day two because we didn't have an excursion. I was, look at, never mind. Uh, today's the end of day three, which uh, was supposed to be uh, Dow's Glacier, but it got rerouted to South Sawyer Glacier. That one. And we went up the Tracy Arm. I was about to say triple arm, so thank you. We went up the Tracy Arm. Uh, to the glacier, and all I have to say is that was unbelievable. Uh, like, that right there was worth the whole cruise, yeah. just doing that one part. So it's crazy to me to think that we still have three more days of Alaska and then a day at sea after that. Yeah, it's insane. Like, I, I mean, obviously, you just saw all the videos from it, and I'm sure it looks beautiful. I hope it looks beautiful. Um, but it's just it's better in person like there's no words to describe it no you, pictures no video yeah. nothing you yeah you it's, just gotta see it it's <laughs> unbelievable and i even counted that we saw i'm totaling it together today we saw probably close to 12 whales at least uh at least humpback whales um and this is an accumulation throughout the whole day and we Right before we were getting ready for bed, oh. saw I would say at least like fifteen to twenty seals. How cool was that? Just coming back from dinner and yeah. seeing out. that outside. Yeah. Oh my gosh, we weren't expecting that at all. Yeah. We were like, it's late, it's bedtime, nothing's gonna be there. Yeah. Oh, there were there were whales and seals. <laughs> yeah, and then I saw two bald eagles. Shine saw three. Yeah, um, <laughs> but you know that in co combination with just all the waterfalls, the icebergs the glacier that we were able to actually see in the background, which we didn't think we were going to get to see at all. That was just an unbelievable, ama unbelievably amazing day. And we thought we were going to be in there for like maybe a couple of hours. We it's were like in there for about day, six to seven hours yeah. just looking at all of those sites that you just saw. It's crazy. So it, it was unbelievable. Tomorrow we are going to be at Skagway and we are going to be going on the White Pass Railroad, the adults only excursion for it. <laughs> and then we're probably going to try doing some hikes that are around the area and then seeing the town. And then after that we have even more fun stuff planned for Juno, including dog sledding and a helicopter tour. And then in Ketchikan we have kayaking at the Tatouche Islands. So we have tons of fun stuff planned to still come in your way. So if you haven't already, like, subscribe, and then turn on on your alerts so that you can find out when we have more adventures posted from this trip because it has been one heck of a trip and we're only two days we in. Even started, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And she missed one excursion. We're also doing a salmon bake after That's our helicopter right. ride. So. Yes, in Juneau we're doing the salmon bake as well that has a really cool waterfall. Beautiful waterfall, beautiful little creek going next to it. So very naturey again, which we love. So yeah, yeah unbelievable things coming around. Um, so thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, we appreciate every single one of you. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. But before we go to bed, can't forget. Can't forget our <laughs> game. This is obviously something we do on cruises. Sometimes we forget, but usually we don't. Um, but this is a brand new game, and it is called Stitch Merry Mischief. <laughs> As you can see, it's still in the plastic wrapping, which means we have never played it before. No so idea. we can't tell you if it's good or if it's bad or whatnot. But I will say it looks very, very similar to the uh, Buddy the Elf game that we showed yesterday. And if it's anything like that, then this will be a very quick and fun game. So we'll have to let you know after we play it how it is. But yeah, besides that, uh, thank you again so much for hanging out with us. We absolutely love doing these videos. We hope it comes across that way. Um, and we're unbelievably excited to show the rest of our trip. Yeah, so. We hope you'll come one and wander with us. But until then, good night. Good night, everyone.